What's the front of your shirt say? I am cheering for Peely Niemer, Big Brother Canada 3. That's what her last name is? Niemer, yeah. Her, sound... She has two last names, Niemer Gonzalez. Oh, I was going to say Niemer is yeah. not Spanish. Yeah, Peely Niemer Gonzalez was her full, is her full name. Oh, I miss her. Huh? I miss her. Yeah, because you friend. said you talk to her every day. Every day, about everything. Still, then why'd you break up? It's a tough time. <laughs> it was, we were just in different places at the time, you know? Like living, physically living? No, we were living together, but in terms of, of life, I had a lot of things I needed to fix. She had some stuff she had to work on, and we just had to get some space, but... You young kids. Get some space. You got nothing but space. How'd your mom and dad feel about you living together? Uh, my mom is pretty conservative. I so know she, she, she is. doesn't prefer it. She's like, don't do it until marriage. But I mean, I, I make. Like, I respect and, and take the advice for sure, but... So she wasn't a huge fan, but she, she understands. You? What's that? Like oh, it loved her. Loved her, yeah. Yeah, they get along really well. I'm sure. It would be hard not to get along with Peely. Oh, she's great. Everyone gets along with Peely. Yeah. She's great. She just seems like one of those nice little funny girls. So kind. Just her and a giggling. Giggle, giggle, giggle. Did Gary ever know her? No, I don't think they ever met. Oh, no, never met? No. It seemed like he knew her. It was weird, wasn't it? It's like, Gare Bear, do you know her? Yeah, Gary didn't like when I talked about her. Why is that? I don't know. Maybe because he liked you. No, I don't think so. You've got a lot of man crushes going on. Have you ever considered going the other way? We have some fun, Karen. Yeah, we don't. <laughs> you don't kiss and I've tell? I've been known to play for both sides once in a while. Don't but... kiss and tell? <laughs> Just dives right into it. Kevin, are you gay? Well, or bi. You know, I just think, live your truth. Yeah, of course. No, I don't hide it. I own it. You got to. It's not a, I mean, there is no stereotype anymore of like good or bad like there used to be. I mean, people still try to do that, but it doesn't exist. It's just fake. It's people being uncomfortable with their own selves in that. Because yeah. what, it's like my dad's saying, like, what the hell do I care if the guy wants to be a girl, like Bruce Jenner is what we were talking about. He's like, yeah. that's his business. I don't give a shit. Like, live, the guy's got to live his life. And I'm like, right on dad. Yeah, exactly. Well said. Like, good. Yeah, I definitely own it. At 76, that's progress. And yeah, not many 76-year-olds think like that. No, not at all. But life's too short not to live your truth. Yeah. People are obsessed with what other people are doing. I mean, it's just crazy. Yeah. People get very obsessed with what other people and are doing. And think that they have an opinion on it. Yeah. And like I tell you all the time, just because I have an opinion different than yours and it doesn't agree with you doesn't make me or you a bad person. It just means we have different opinions. People consider having a different opinion that you're accepting or condoning the behavior. It's just no. People are allowed to have a different opinion. But today, people think you can't have an opinion. It's like, yes, you can still have an opinion. Sorry, but you can. Mm -hmm. And if it differs from somebody else's, that's they're allowed to still do that. That's their opinion. Mm -hmm. Doesn't have to agree. 